Today is one of those experimental Jack got a weird idea day. And I thought, I saw this easy corn dog recipe and I thought, nah, corn dogs are just corn dogs. But I want monster corn dogs. So we're doing monster corn dogs today. I don't know if it's gonna work. Come on in, let's get this started right now. Today's monster corn dogs are these special, I found these beef and cheddar smoked sausage right there. Isn't that awesome? I got my sugar, I got my egg, got my baking powder, salt and pepper, milk, yellow cornmeal mix, and all-purpose flour. Either way, looks good to me. So let's get this started. I have not done this before, so this is gonna be interesting to see if it turns out right. All right, first thing I'm gonna do, I'm going to open these packages, and I'm gonna, we're gonna do six of them. I'm not using all these. Get the big packet, I'll put the rest in, use that for maybe like, I don't know, sausage, peppers, and eggs or something cool, really cool. All right, here's the interesting part. You're gonna straighten these out and you put your stick in. You're gonna put your stick in about three-fourths of the way. So let's do that right now. And make sure you don't come out the side. There we go. And when you're done with all of these, then put them on a, like a paper towel and get them dry. You wanna dry them off. First thing we do is make our batter, so let's get that going right now. Now I wanna make my batter in this jar. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pour all my dry ingredients in here. The yellow cornmeal, the flour, the salt, the salt. Come on boys and girls, get in there. The pepper. The baking powder. And the sugar. Then I'm gonna mix it all in here. Make sure it's all mixed good. I'm gonna slowly pour this into my mug. Put my egg in here. Pour my milk in there. Hot dogs will be long enough. Nope, I'll have to get a more narrow cup. Let's see. Fit in here. Yeah, it'll fit in there. Now, you can put a lid on this, just stick it in the refrigerator. I'm gonna lid this and let it chill a little bit. It does even better when it's cold. So put this in the refrigerator for like 15, 20, 30 minutes. I'm doing 30 minutes, and then I'm gonna lay my plate out and get my, my monster corn dogs coated with just regular flour. Okay, first thing we're gonna do is roll this in the flour. Get it all dry it out. I like to just kind of cover it. Get the whole thing covered in flour. There we go. I'm gonna dunk it in. It's probably gonna overflow. I don't care. I gotta dunk it in and go. All right, make sure you don't overflow it. There we go. <laughs> wow. That's crazy. That's a ton of batter in there. Let's get it in there cooking. Get it to rotate a little bit. Oh, that didn't work. It's coming off the hot dog right now. First time ever, it didn't work well. That was a failure. We can do it without the flour. Here we go. I think that worked better. Oh, failed. It won't hold. Okay, so let's look at my disaster here. 
The one with the flower coating, that adhered better, but not completely. I don't think that you can coat these. And then this one didn't have any flower coating, it came right off. Okay, so a few thoughts come to mind. I turned up the heat on the oil. The recipe said medium. I'm doing a, a medium high, okay? Number two, we know that rolling it in flour helps it adhere. So we're gonna try that right now. I'm gonna place it in. Wish me luck, everybody. Wish me luck. Not gonna happen. Not happening today, you guys. It just won't adhere to the, see, it comes right off. All right, well, I almost did it. I almost did it. This one looks the best, doesn't it? I almost got it coated completely. I'm gonna try that in a minute. Let these cool down a little bit. Best advice my mom ever gave me, don't worry about failure. Because every time you fail, you're that much closer to success. So uh, I'm closer to making this happen. I will come back with another different video for monster dogs. I just don't know what I'm gonna use yet. These sausages almost did it. That one looks pretty good right there. So I'm gonna give that a try. Here we go. Mmm. All right, so thanks for joining me. Sorry it didn't work out, but good news. Next week, I have another smoking episode. So be ready, because next Friday, we're smoking maple bacon. It's gonna be awesome. Be ready for that. I know that's not gonna fail, because it's on my Traeger. Take care, bye-bye. Oh, wait a minute. You guys, did you leave yet? Look, I did these two. They're not completely coated, see? They didn't do very well, but they're the best two that I made. I just want to show you before you go. I'm not giving up. I'm going to keep trying. Anyway, there you go. There's a shot of my best two of the day. I will see you later. Take care. Bye-bye.